and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a charcoal effect. On the left we've got a photo, then we press Ctrl D, I drag the copy to the right, hit select it, I go to extensions, raster and there's a charcoal option. It's a simple menu, let me check the live preview. And we've got the radius and the sigma. The higher you go, obviously the more details you've got. But for the most part with the radius you want to keep it fairly low. Maybe up to 3, 4, 5 at max. Let me go to 2 in this example. You can increase the sigma and you will see that some details will be added, especially here in the bird. But at some point you can go higher and higher, it doesn't matter. So if we compare for example the results that we've got with 20 to the results that we had with around 5, it's almost the same. So it depends a little bit on the radius that you use, what the sigma adds as an effect. When you've got what you want, just apply it and you can add this effect multiple times. For example, you can target the sigma first with a small radius and then apply it again with a higher radius and then play around with the sigma. But in most cases, it's enough to just apply it once. And when you've got that selected, go to File, Export and it's done. And this is how you can add a charcoal effect in Inkscape. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.